What's up guys, Sick Crazy or Crazy HD, and today I'm bringing you guys just a commentary about cheese sticks. So, you guys may be like thinking, why the hell is he going to talk about for four and a half minutes about cheese sticks? Well, the thing is, I feel bad for most of you guys, because I know some of you guys aren't from this area, and I mean some of you are, some of you are from where I live, from like the Philadelphia area, um, but you guys... The, the ones that aren't from around this area, um, I, I've met a couple of these, and you guys have said you've never been to the Philadelphia area, so you've never had a real Philly cheesesteak. Well, I was actually having a conversation with a kid who's from California, um, and he said that he has had a Philly cheesesteak, and then I was like, oh, where'd you go? And he said, oh, uh, someplace in Rhode Island. I was like, no, no, no. A Philly cheesesteak. They may call it a Philly cheesesteak, but it's not a real one. Uh, a real Philly cheesesteak you can only get in Philadelphia and the surrounding areas, um, like halfway into New Jersey. And the only place you can really get it outside of the Philadelphia area is Wawa, which is a Philadelphia based company. It's like right outside of Philadelphia. So, like, I feel bad because you guys have never had the privilege that I have. You, you, and you have to get whiz on it. You can't get, like, just American cheese. You have to get cheese whiz. And everybody, whoever visits this area, always says, What is your guys' obsession with whiz? I have no idea what our obsession with cheese whiz is. But it's good. So I don't know why you knock it. Don't knock it till you try it. Uh, you gotta get cheese whiz and fried onions. It makes it great. Um, and if you're ordering, you have to say wit or without. Um, I never say wit or without unless I'm ordering a cheesesteak um, because otherwise the places won't serve you and I don't know why everybody thinks just people from Philly talk like that I only hear at the cheesesteak places if you guys are wondering but I, so I feel bad because you guys have never had like a real cheesesteak and don't get me wrong I'm not saying that cheesesteaks aren't good if they're not Philly cheesesteaks but we're like the inventors uh, you gotta try you gotta try one from this area Cause we know what a good cheesesteak tastes like. Like uh, the thumbnail of this video, it's Pat's Cheesesteaks. Uh, Pat's King of Steaks is the name of the website, and, and the name of the place, is the official name. And uh, I went there with my sister and a girl from New York, and she was making fun of us because of the wit or wit out thing. And um, but like at Pat's, or no, I think she went. I think we went to Gino's one day. Not Pat's. Uh, it, the, the thumbnail is Pat's, but I'm saying at Gino's. If you don't say wit or wit out, they make fun of you and you don't get it. Like you, Gino's and Pat's is disputed over who made the first one, but I think it was Pat's. I'm not sure. Um, personally, I like Gino's better. Um, you guys are wondering. But like I said, you can get them from a place. You don't have to go to Pat's or Gino's or Tony Luke's to get it. You can go to other places to get them. Um, and the reason I'm being so specific with those names is because... If you're in Philly and you hear those names, you, you'll hear them all over the city, so it doesn't really give away where I'm from, which I kind of been secretive about uh, exactly where I mean. So anyway, if, if you guys have never had the privilege, if you ever come to the Philadelphia area, try to make that something that you guys can do, because it's really a good, quick meal, and they're not that expensive. Um, and you don't have, like I said, you don't have to go to Pat's or Gino's or Tony Luke's. You can go to one of the other restaurants, and they're cheaper there, because, uh, it's like 12 bucks if you want to get it. Or it's 14 bucks if you, from Pat's if you want to get a cheesesteak, fries, and a drink. So it's not cheap. So uh, I guess, guys, comment down below if you've ever had a real Philly cheesesteak from the Philadelphia area. Don't say you've had a Philly cheesesteak from a restaurant that claims it's a Philly cheesesteak, but it's not. If, you're in, if you've been in the Philadelphia area, tell me if you have or not. I made the mistake of having one in North Carolina, but that's going to do it for this video, guys. Comment, like, subscribe, follow me on Twitter, be down description below. As always, guys, this has been Sick Crazy. Hopefully you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you guys in the next video. Thanks for watching. Have a great day.